My name's Lori Fitzgerald. I knew I had to be proactive as far as making sure I had all grants and scholarships possible. Um, I'm not ashamed to say that I'm on public assistance and we just do everything we can to live as normal of a life within the parameters that we have. Man, just the little extra money can play a big part in anything. Like, you know, as college students, we, we need to get food, like we have to pay rent, like we have to, you know, get things that are gonna help us, necessities, like it's, it's all key. Like, so that little boost of money, even if it's not like a lot, that's a, that's a big help for a college student. My kids also see, you know, we had a very nice middle class life while I was married and they remember that. Then they know what it's like being on government assistance with me being a single mom. They understand what it is not to be able to buy food that month because of some paperwork glitch and you don't have food stamps for the month. They know what it's like to eat out of a can. And for them to see that this education is a way out for me, they have grasped onto that themselves. They know that education isn't something that you can just scoff at and hope that you can do later. They really grasp the importance of the education. They know that there are scholarships they will miss out on if they don't if they are not serious about it now. And he came down to the bookstore and he was like, I have good news. And I was like, what? He was like, dude, you just got a scholarship. I was like, awesome. I was like, that's, I was like, just kind of a little speechless there. So, I mean, cause like I said, if, even if it wasn't this scholarship, like any scholarship from the school itself, like that's just an honor. Like, that means you've been recognized for your hard work, so. It was, it was a good feeling. It's still trying to, it's still settling in a little bit. Thank you to the family, like the Barnes family. Thank you, I appreciate it a lot. Um, I know a lot of times people don't want to offer because they think people are just greedy and want to take, take, take. So to have people that continue to give brings the best out of those of us who receive. Now what made me what inspired me to give a scholarship. I thought about my own past. You know, when I was a junior uh, at Kokomo High School, I actually was awarded a $500 scholarship. Now, a $500 scholarship in 1968 will go a very long ways as opposed to a $500 scholarship here in 2013, 2014. And then I watched our own children uh, receive scholarships once they graduated from high school. And so we know as a family, the Barneses know as a family, how valuable a scholarship means to your completion, the ease of your completion, um, and how much more fun college can be. You don't have to worry about the debt and you don't have to worry about the expense.